Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to Assassin's Creed Origins. There's been a new update, and with it comes a new Final Fantasy XV Easter egg in the form of a quest. So what I wanted to do for this video, since Saturdays are normally reserved for kind of Let's Play videos, I'll split this video into two sections. I'll do a quick rundown of the most important parts of the Easter egg now, which means all of you losers who don't want to stick around for the full video can leave after that. And for everyone else, all of the really cool people, we'll jump into some more Let's Play style questing after to take a look at the Easter egg in a lot more detail. Anyway, the new quest called A Gift From The Gods opens up a new temple to explore and takes place in pretty much the same area as the original Final Fantasy XV easter egg. The quest basically involves solving a puzzle, at which point you'll see a cutscene featuring some Final Fantasy XV characters, I don't know who they are, and once you complete it, you'll receive some items which I also have no idea what they are. One's called the Ultima Blade, one is a shield called Zydrich, or something, and the final beautiful thing is a legendary mount that looks suspiciously like a camel cosplaying as a chocobo. Anyway, that's it for part one. Let's now hand over to an even more handsome version of myself to go into the quest a bit deeper. Psst, this is where all the losers leave. Okay, we have arrived at the new quest location. I'm not quite sure what's going to happen once I actually get here. But um, actually, how do I, I've forgotten how to get off the horse. I haven't played in a while. There we go. Right, let's have a quick look, see what happens. Okay, well, that's definitely something. Have they sent a message from the sky? It's as if Ra has descended upon us. I'll tell you what, that looks like it's in the location of the old Final Fantasy Easter Egg, which I guess makes sense. If, if you've seen that old one, there is just down here, there is a like mural of them, or hieroglyphics of some of the Final Fantasy characters. Here we go, what are we going to find? Ooh. The fireball has revealed an entrance to this tomb. This is a sign from the gods. Should we interact with it? A large stone, glowing blue, that fell from the sky. I can't even read. Brilliant. Yeah, you can see that just over there, that is where the old Final Fantasy Easter egg is. And let's see what this new one's going to have for us. <laughs> Brilliant. Uh, you can see just there, it says XV, that's 15, as in Final Fantasy 15. Could this be referring to a sundial? I wonder. This number seems important. So I am going to say, I'm not actually familiar with Final Fantasy, so if there is like imagery from this, then I'm not quite going to get it. Oh look, there's the two characters again. That's the same as we see outside. This number seems important. Yeah, I've already said that, mate. Solve the sundial puzzle. How on earth do I do that? Do I have to shoot something? Oh, it's outside. Okay, that makes sense. I'm guessing it's going to be something to do with whatever this is. Ah, there we go. That was depicted in the tomb. Now, how do I do this? Have I got to be here at a certain time of day? That might be a thing. Oh! Noises! What's going on? Okay. Um, something over there just opened. What is that? I don't know if that's important. Oh, look, over there's opened as well. Oh, a few of them have opened. Why is this middle one not opened? I'm, I'm a bit confused as to why some of them have opened and some of them haven't. Where is the sun right now? Oh! Wait, did I do that? What just happened? Did I, is this like a button? Oh, I'm so confused. I am genuinely lost right now. The only thing I can imagine it being is like based on what time it is. 15 would be 3 o'clock, which would be over there. But then I don't know why those ones opened on their own. And then I don't know why they closed either. I'm a bit confused. Oh, they're opening again. 
the same ones are opening. Oh, maybe I've got to shoot them. Oh, of course I've got to shoot them. Um, I don't know what that actually did. Oh, okay. Is that activating that one? Oh, apparently it's activated three of them. Okay, I, I didn't consider that. I'm not sure how I did that, but I, I really don't know. In we go again. Alright, what's going on in here? Ooh, that's different. Blue fire. What's that? Phosphorus, isn't it? Blue fire. one of the characters. I'm not sure though. Well, that was literally one of the weirdest things I've ever seen in this game. And oh my god, I just saw what mount I got. Oh, I'm excited. Let's go outside. So then, that's the extent of the quest. We've got some really cool new items. Um, how do I get my sword out? I've completely forgot. That's not a sword. There we go. There's the sword. Um, these are, I assume, Final Fantasy designs or maybe they're something from the game. I really don't know Final Fantasy. But I think the most important thing to come out of this brand new quest is... Um, well, my new mount, which I am currently trying to... There we go. Oh, my God. It's it's half chocobo, half camel. I, I'm, I don't know how to feel about that. It's kind of horrific, and I kind of love it because of that.